morning, 21 country. You're taking a live look of downtown Fort Wayne from our sky cam. We're seeing OK driving conditions, you know, reduced visibility along with some light rain. So on your way out uh, to work or going to church, you might want to grab the umbrella as we'll see widespread showers. And then as we get towards the afternoon, you could just keep it handy with you. you don't really need it, but you could just leave in the back of your car uh, this afternoon. Storm track radar shows widespread showers. Most of it is light, but you can tell in some pockets uh, that, that are shaded orange and yellow. That indicates a little bit moderate to a little bit heavier rainfall, but we still have plenty of showers off towards our west. So again, it's going to be a rainy morning for us. And so here's our future track of what our uh, morning looks like as we get towards about two o'clock. That cold front begins to move out of our region. So all the widespread showers become more isolated as we could see a little bit a little bit of a, a lake effect showers uh, this afternoon. They'll be isolated to scattered showers. And then by around six o'clock, we should gradually clear out and we'll see a, a sunny start uh, for Monday. And so we're really not going to see that much rain close to about a quarter inch to a half an inch of rain. Some pockets could see maybe a half an inch are indicated in the blue areas. So it's really not much, but for our farmers in our northern counties, they can take what we can get. And so right now they're still in a moderate drought, so they definitely need the rain. They'll get a little bit today. That's all thanks to this cold front that's passing through this morning. Once that system is exits our region with our winds coming out from the northwest, we'll start to see some moisture and that's going to cause that lake effect of uh, showers popping up. It's going to be a few little bands of light rain showers. Once that system is out of our region, a high pressure system begins to settle in and that's going to bring us plenty of sunshine and blue skies and that will continue uh, for the next five days. Precipitation chances again, it shows it's going to be a rainy day today, but from Monday through Thursday, we're expecting very dry conditions. So let's talk about the temperatures. Now it is pretty comfortable, still chilly in the mid to upper 40s, 47 degrees in Fort Wayne and Defiance and a little warmer off towards our east at 50 degrees into Van Wert. And that's because uh, when a cold front moves ahead of the cold front is warmer weather, but behind the cold front is much cooler air. And that's why we're seeing all these greens and blues um, off towards our west. And so temperatures are really not going to increase that much. We should reach our highs this afternoon somewhere around the mid 50s. And then with the clouds clearing, temperatures will drop overnight into the uh, mid to upper 30s for us. So we could see some frost uh, coming through. So if you have any sensitive plants, make sure you keep them covered or bring them inside uh, before tonight. And now look in the next seven days, we should be back into the 60s by Monday and then into Tuesday will be around average for us in the upper 60s, maybe even 70s, mostly sunny skies that will continue uh, all the way through Friday. We could reach in 70 degrees by Wednesday and then next weekend looks much warmer as we could be back into the mid 70s. All right, looking forward.